Here's the view from the Stratosphere camera overlooking our 40-acre stunt site on the Las Vegas Strip. Daredevil stunt cyclist Pat McGrorty is getting ready to shoot the curl on a motorcycle. Here's how it's supposed to work. Pat will rev up his Honda CR250 dirt bike and race towards a row of 10 cars. The full-size sedans each weigh about 3,500 pounds. As you can see, they're lined up nose first into the ground, and they're being suspended by a quarter-inch steel cable. Just before Pat reaches the first car, there's going to be a massive explosion, which will set off a thundering chain reaction. The cars, which are loaded with gasoline and gunpowder bombs, will come crashing down like a row of steel dominoes. Hopefully, Pat will be able to stay one step ahead of that 35,000-pound killer wave and shoot out safely on the other side. Obviously, if Pat and his stunt crew's timing isn't perfect, this incredibly dangerous stunt could end in disaster. I'm standing with the stunt coordinator, Ron Altoff. Ron, tell me why this stunt is so dangerous. Well, for a lot of reasons. you got a man pushing a button, telling a visual. It's got to be, you know, perfect. Ron's job is to trigger the first explosion. This will set off the chain reaction of crashing cars. If his timing is off by even one second, Pat can be crushed beneath tons of unstoppable steel. you got 106 feet, and you got to travel that in 3.5 seconds. You're talking about pushing the button to start the pyrotechnics. Once, once, once the button's pushed, it's not in our hands. It's in, in, in uh, Pat's hands. And once Pat hits the gas, there's no turning back. Motorcycle daredevil Pat McGrady is taking one last ride past a row of 10 cars that will, if all goes as planned, come crashing down behind him. He calls it shooting the curl. That traffic cone is the starting lap. Pat must keep his bike right on top of the orange line as each of the 3,500 pound cars slams down behind him. You like that? It was perfect. All right, we're ready. Okay, follow the line. Okay. Pat's getting some last minute advice from the stunt team before he rolls into his starting position. Okay. Yeah, over there. On me. Okay. Are they going to load up the bomb? And he looks ready to go. I see that. He circled around and is poised at the starting line. It looks like Pat is taking a few moments to gather his thoughts. There's crew member Ron Altoff. He'll be triggering the explosion that will cause the chain reaction of falling cars. The critical timing of this stunt is up to him. Ron's just waiting for the starting signal. Everything seems to be ready, and he's off. Ron's powering up that bike. His speed must be constant or he could be in grave danger. There's the explosion, and here come the cars. And Pat makes it. Unbelievable. Pat McGrory shoots the curl and makes it look easy. As Connie heads over to Pat, let's take another look at this dangerous race against time. Incredibly, Pat manages to keep his cool. He hits the right speed and hugs that orange line while the wave of cars come crashing down behind him. In a stunt where inches count, that split-second timing makes the difference. Now let's go to Connie. Go talk to him. All right, Pat. Congratulations. How'd it look? It looked great. Oh, it looked great. awesome. Oh. So no problems whatsoever. No, no, the bike works great. Got a little adrenaline going, which is nice, you know? A great team out there. I was confident. It's a big part of it. Thank you. A big part of it is just preparing for the stunt, you know, taking the time necessary and preparing, okay. which we did. And uh, I was in great hands. I was confident about that. As, as you were going through, what did you see? What do, what do you see out of your eyes? Did you see the explosion? I uh, didn't see them, and I didn't dare turn around because I might have turned right into it, but um, I could hear the boom, 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 boom right behind me. And it had a real nice, fast time and ring to it. You know, it's just like happening one boom after another. Very dangerous, never been attempted before, and again, you made it look very easy. Congratulations. Well, thank you. Pat McGrorty pulls it off. It's an impressive tribute to his close friend and mentor, Dar Robinson. Congratulations, Pat.